Wireless Networks Part A 2 Marks Unit 1 Wireless LAN What is Infrared Transmission? Infrared Light Transmission is one of the important technology used in wireless LAN. It is based on the transmission of infrared light at 900 nanometer wavelength. What is the advantage and disadvantage of infrared technology? Advantage Shielding is easy and no need for license for infrared technology. Electrical devices do not interfere with infrared transmission. Disadvantage Low bandwidth cannot penetrate through the walls. What is the need for WiMAX? The main reason for the development of WiMAX World Interoperability Microwave Access is the demand of high data rates not only the faster downloading but also for the use of new application like video streaming, multimedia conferencing and interactive gaming. What is WiMAX? WiMAX is the AIR interface for the actual radio interface network where both fixed and mobile users can have access to the network. Its specification is IEEE 802.16. Define spread spectrum. Spread spectrum involves spreading the bandwidth needed to transmit data. The main advantage of using a spread spectrum is the resistance to narrow interference. What is IEEE 802.11? IEEE 802.11 is the first WLAN standard that has secured the market in large extent. The primary goal of the standard was the specification of a simple and robust that offers time bounded and asynchronous services. What are the spread spectrum techniques? They are two different methods for Spread Spectrum Transmission Direct Sequence Spread Spectrum Frequency Hoping Spread Spectrum What are the function of MAC layer in IEEE 802.11? The function of MAC layer are Media Access Control Reliable Delivery of Data Unit Management Function Authentication and Encryption Define SIFS the shortest IFS used for the high priority frames like acknowledgement frames, CTS frames, fold response, etc. What is DIFS? TCF IFS is used for transmitting data frame. It is equal to SIFS plus 2 time slot and is the longest interframe gap. Please subscribe our channel for more videos and educational contents.